Considering legal action against uh, CNN about the story that they put out, uh, we have not formulated our exact plan yet, but we are in talks about that, and we're very serious and intentional about doing it. How are you going to run without your top campaign aides? Uh, we're not worried about that either. We're, we are in contact with a lot of folks. We've got uh, resumes coming in like crazy. We've got people who've already stepped up to the plate to help us. We are confident that we have a team of people that we're going to be able to put together that are going to be able to carry this uh, campaign to victory. So we're we're confident in that. What can you do to prove that you were not on those sites? Uh, again, uh, we're going to, we're not going to fight that out here because that's what CNN wants us to do. What we're going to do is we're going to reiterate our 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 thoughts again, and we're going to reiterate what I said in there. While this country is literally facing a crisis situation on the world stage, while our border is wide open, while our businesses are struggling, while folks are dying from fentanyl, while crime is spiraling out of control, you folks want to focus on tabloid trash, and quite frankly, I am sick of it. And every time I get in front of you, I'm going to cut you off and tell you, you need to refocus yourself on the issues that matter to people. And 15-year-old sensational lies don't matter to people. What matters to people is how they're going to make it in this state, how they're going to make a living, how they're going to get educated, how they're going to protect their children from crime and drugs. That's what matters in this state. You all have been unwilling to share my message with the general population. You follow me to every church. You follow me to every meeting. You've heard what I've said. You refuse to share my words with folks. But make no, mistakes about, make no mistake about it, folks. That's not going to deter me to continue to do it. If you all don't want to deliver the message to the people of North Carolina and they have a champion in me, then we will. And that's the last thing I have to say about it. Do you feel that former President Trump has abandoned you? Can you flesh out your here. policy about the groups of people that you would like to kill? Thank you. Mr. Robinson, can you address the issue of the groups of the people that you would like to have killed? I guess not. Is that going to come up in the policy speaker? You're really good. Nice guy. I'm a person. 